Mary Winston and large is what I need. That down. Hey, hey. Did you give this to Frankie? You can't read that. Yes, I can. To Frankie, who makes me look forward to tomorrow. Give it. Oh, Cass, you wrote this. Would you please give that to me? Wow. You must really be serious. I just don't want to jinx it, okay? Cass, how are you going to jinx things with Frankie if you just tell me how serious I it is? Don't I don't want to talk about it. Okay, I don't want to hear about it. Well, maybe I'll talk about it a little. Ah, oh, good. Things seem to have picked up since that building fell on us. Yeah. Well, things like that have a way of bringing people closer together. Yeah, obviously I don't expect everything to be perfect. No, no, but you expect the occasional smile from someone whose life you just <laughs> saved, right? <laughs> yeah, right. Can you believe I did that, Stace? I went into that building knowing full well it was about to blow. I know. You should have seen the look on the foreman's face. Mm, talk about blind. You weren't blind. God, you were being really heroic. Though I know that's how I appeared. I'm not the hero type, Stace, you know. Oh, gee, uh, I'm, I'm shocked. Uh, Just knock it off, okay? Cass, the fact is you were being very brave. All I could think about was Frankie. Oh, that sounds like love. Oh, will you stop with that? Oh, that sounds like love. It you does. You sound so foolish. Oh. And like I said, I don't want to jinx it, okay? I got to tell you about last night. You won't what believe this. This night? guy came last night. Wait a second. <laughs> you're gonna love it. Hello, Cass Winthrop. Oh, yes, Mr. Levinson. How are we today? Oh, no. Oh, that's rough. Having a partner that's not honest with you is a terrible thing. Well, actually, sir, that's, that's not my specialty. Yes, sir, I'm aware of the fact that uh, our firm is on retainer with you, but... Mr. Levinson, don't, no, don't get your blood pressure going here. We don't have to yell. I'll, I'll see what I can do about it, okay? All right, sir, today, okay? G goodbye, sir. Let me guess what happened. Mr. Levinson's partner... Barlow. Barlow. Mr. Barlow. Mr. Barlow, who never breathed an honest breath in his life, has once again temporarily tied up some uh, corporate funds. You got it. Aha, uh -huh, and he wants you to mediate. No, he wants me to threaten and cajole. Yes, the guy's a thug. You think I don't know that? So what are you going to do? Well, I may be brave, but I'm not stupid. Well, that's... Hey, how are you? Hi, Derek. Derek! Hey, hey have I got a job for you? Hey, Cass, you feel okay? Job. Good job.